Hi, my name is Yuxia Wu from Singapore Management University. Today, I'm going to share our work about on the feasibility of simple transformer for dynamic graph modeling. Existing works include discrete time approaches and continuous time approaches. Discrete approaches regard dynamic graphs as a sequence of snapshots over a discrete set of time steps. However, they discard the fine-grained temporal information within the snapshot. Continuous approaches retain full temporal details capturing long-term dependency remains a difficult problem. Furthermore, many works rely on the message passing GNNs shows limitations of oversmoothing and oversquashing. To addressing these limitations, we have been intrigued by the successful application of Transformer in NLP and CV. It can naturally support a continuous sequence of data without the need for discrete snapshots, and its self-attention mechanism can capture long-term dependency. There are two challenges to use Transformer for dynamic graph modeling. The first challenge lies in the need to preserve the historical evolution throughout the entire timeline. The second challenge lies in the need to align temporal information across input sequences. Based on the above insights, we propose a simple Transformer architecture for dynamic graph modeling, named SimpleDiG. The overall framework of SimpleDiG is illustrated in this figure. Our framework is applied to a dynamic graph backslash math al g, where multiple temporal links emerge at various time points. In order to capture the dynamic evolution, we begin by extracting a temporal ego graph for each ego node, which contains the entire historical interactions as shown in figure b. These temporal graphs are subsequently transformed into sequences while preserving their chronological order. To incorporate temporal alignment among different ego graphs, we segment the timeline into various time spans with the same temporal interval as in figure C. Then, we add temporal tokens into the ego sequence to identify different time spans. Finally, these sequences are fed into a transformer architecture to facilitate various downstream tasks. We conduct extensive experiments on four public datasets across different domains with comparison to the state-of-the-art baselines. Generally speaking, our method outperforms all the baselines on all datasets. We find that continuous time approaches generally perform better than discrete ones across a wide range of scenarios, indicating the important role of time-related information in dynamic graph analysis. Here we make some summary about our work. Thank you for your listening. If you are interested in our work, please feel free to torch out.